This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. What's up, everybody? This is Luke Patrick with the iPhoneAppReview.com. Today, we're slinging out yet another video review, this time taking a look at an application called PromptSmart that is uh, extremely innovative, definitely a good utility for those that do a lot of public speaking. Um, and though it comes with a high price tag, it's a very well-designed application, and it's one that has lots of potential to improve the efficaciousness of your public speaking which I'm doing a little bit of now. Hopefully I'm doing well enough. All right, so let's go ahead and just kind of jump into how Prompt Smart works. Um, this is the main menu, and uh, to give a brief summary, within this application, you're mostly going to do um, a lot of the script library reading, presumably. And what that does is essentially it allows you to upload various documents, which you can do by simply tapping this, import script, or you can add a new script, and then write your own. Um, there's also a settings portion right here, which you can change any portion of the uh, bit that we're about to show you via the settings in here. It'll make more sense in a second. You can search or sort alphabetically. But what does it actually look like? Well, let's go ahead and pull up one of the included documents. We've got Winston Churchill's Famous Finest Hour uh, speech, which is right here. And as we scroll through it, it is exactly what you think it is, the Finest Hour speech. This is what came with the application, this and the Gettysburg Address. We're going to go with this just because I kind of like Churchill, not more than I like Abe Lincoln, just uh, small personal preference there, so we're going to go with that. Um, and then you might be wondering, how do we do the prompt thing that uh, you would assume that uh, the, the application comes with? Um, well, simply do this, and then hit the big old play button right here at the bottom. Let it load up for just a second. Which we boast when an absolute guarantee against invasion, still less against serious raids, could have been given to our people. In the days of Napoleon, the same wind which would have carried his transports across the channel might have driven away the blockading fleet. There was always the chance, and it is that chance which has ex excited and befooled the imaginations of many continental tyrants. And you get a feel of what's going on here, but essentially, as I read, the application will scroll automatically. How does it do this? Well, mostly through recognizing the text that I'm reading. So as I read the text, and I've stopped reading it now, so it's not actually scrolling, but as I read the text, it will automatically scroll. This is using a voice track technology that's being currently, and it's in process of being patented. Um, but it's truly awesome stuff, especially if you do a lot of public speaking, you can easily see the value in this. As you uh, need to, you can boot this application up, um, boot up your script, and then just start reading. And if you're doing what I'm doing right now, where you happen to be off course, let's say you need to crack a joke or someone uh, heckles in a funny way and you need to respond at that big corporate retreat or whatever, the application will pause, and then when you need to read again, it will actually uh, resume doing that. Um, so the voice track technology here is really cool. And um, generally speaking, we've had an excellent uh, time with it. It has very rarely chugged. I think we had one instance where I did a lot of talking uh, in between reads, and then it eventually did... Um, go into uh, the scrolling again, uh, but it was a bit choppy and it didn't quite work well. But that was a very extreme situation, which I did a lot of outside talking before jumping back. Um, so generally speaking, great experience and no complaints. Uh, we're going to go ahead and jump out of that and go back to our text. That's what's uh, most attractive about this application is that uh, active track sort of um, technology that they've included. It works phenomenally well, and obviously there's a great value in that. Um, what else do we want to talk about? Well, let's see. The application also comes with a note card library, which in case you don't want to do a full speech, let's just say that you want to do an outline, uh, which a lot of people do, then you can add specific note cards. So I've got just a basic test card that I've added here, but if I want to add more, I can hit that and then type in some more stuff. So test it, test it, save it, and then go back. Now I've got another card, and in this way I can, uh, you know, read straight off of the thing. Um, and then it will actually uh, do these. So if I say lore reps and lore, um, I can do that and then slide back and forth between these. So again, just the perfect speech utility. The idea is obviously to uh, ensure that you have all of the necessary resources for your upcoming speech right there ready to go. Uh, they want to arm you as much as possible, especially with that uh, voice tracking software, and it works really well. Outside of this, there's not too much else to mention other than there is a recording library. If you want to practice your speech ahead of time, you can record it and then listen back to it at any point in time. That's quite useful, uh, especially if you're really nervous about it, which obviously the entire point of Prompt Smart, even as you know, directed by the CEO himself, um, the point is to uh, basically ensure that you have as many tools and as many options available to you as possible to ensure that your public speaking goes well. 
Um, public speaking is actually the number one fear of Americans. Uh, there was a recent psychological study that uh, um, verified that, even more so than death. It's kind of interesting. Um, so obviously there's a need for something like Prompt Smart, and in our experience, it's been really easy to use, and we've really greatly enjoyed it. Um, it does cost $10 in the iTunes App Store, which is quite a lot. Um, though, if you do a lot of public speaking, you will very quickly find the value in this. You can also customize just about anything that's included here, down to text size. You can do mirrored text for classic glass teleprompter rigs. Um, and generally speaking, the software works really, really well, so we've had no problems with it. Um, and all in all, it, is, it does exactly what you would expect it to do, and then some, which is kind of the point. Um, so with all of that in mind, we are going to give the application... Um, a, uh, I'll do that later, thank you. Um, we are going to give it a 4.5 out of 5 star rating from us here at the iPhone App Review. And we think it's a great app, especially if you're uh, a little bit scared to do any form of public speaking and you need some extra assistance. This is easily a good way to go. Alright, and again, that's a prompt smart rating of 4.5 out of 5 stars from us here at the iPhone App Review.com. And that's all I have to say, so I'm going to go ahead and sign out, but we will see you guys later. Bye.